99% of Fortune 500 companies are using AI during their recruitment process. Recruitment algorithms have been around for a while, and they're not going anywhere. Your resume might look perfect to a human, but if you don't understand how these systems work, you probably won't get the job. That's where I can help. I'm Anna, a professional career writer here at Resume.io, and in this video, we'll explore how AI is used in hiring and how you can use AI to fight back. Applying to jobs has gotten a lot more convenient over the years. On certain sites, you can even apply to multiple openings with just one click. But that ease of use means recruiters can get hundreds or even thousands of applications for a single position. To save time sorting through them all, virtually every large company has turned to AI. And it's not just to read your resume. Many companies also use virtual interview assistants or AI-powered tests to evaluate your skills and personality. In other words, a robot might really decide whether you get the job or not. But you don't have to leave it to chance. Let's look at some ways that you can use the power of AI to overcome common hiring obstacles. The first is with your resume. I've made a whole video about how applicant tracking systems are used in hiring, so make sure to check that out. But basically how it works is that an algorithm scans your resume for keywords programmed in by the company as being important for the role. It compares you with other applicants and filters out candidates who don't make the cut. Up to 75% of resumes can get filtered out at this stage. Here's how we can keep that from happening to you. The first thing you're going to do is copy the job description for the role you're applying to and paste it into ChatGPT or another chatbot. Ask ChatGPT to pull out the most important skills and responsibilities from the job description that should be used on a resume for this position. These are your keywords. You can also take this a step further by feeding ChatGPT pieces of your current resume and asking it to help you insert those keywords into the most appropriate places. Be careful with this, however. You'll probably need to adjust the responses to fit your actual experience. The second place that AI comes up a lot is during the interviewing process. Some companies use an AI-powered voice assistant to give you an initial callback. Other times, you might be asked to do a video interview with an AI-based avatar. In either case, it can seem a bit unnerving that the person on the other end of the line is not a person at all. The best way to deal with this is to practice. Sites like Career.io offer an AI-powered interview room where you can choose from the most common questions for your field and practice answering in front of a computer-generated hiring manager. You can watch recordings of your interview and even get feedback on your answers. AI is changing the future of work, and it starts from the moment you submit your application. But you don't have to be a bystander. By taking control of the situation and using AI tools to your advantage, you can land the job with confidence and ease. Make sure to follow Resume.io for more career tips and advice for job seekers. 